our strategy is to do join all domains C2, air, land, sea, space, cyber. Unfortunately, I think some people have been confused around the world that believe that, and they, they would probably pick the worst analogy, which is nuclear weapons, and superimpose it on cyber. And there's nothing that could be worse <laughs> because they're two different worlds completely. The capabilities to be able to produce a nuclear weapon or a cyber effect are on opposite ends of the spectrum. The reason why I bring that up is they carry that analogy further and they believe that we will only play this game of responding in kind like we had mutually assured destruction uh, with nuclear weapons. That is a false premise and could lead people down a very, very wrong road. So in 2011, we made very clear, if you have cyber effects that are on the same level as any other weapon, we may come back at you not with cyber, but with some other kinetic strategy. A lot of people who were banking on this in-kind game plan rapidly destroyed all of their war plans because they thought they could hit us and they could absorb our cyber blow. Both bad premises. So I think when you have the synergistic nature of air, land, sea, space, cyber, and not separate them out, then it's just another tool in your toolbox and you're not gonna put a round peg in a square hole. You are gonna use the precise weapon in the precise scenario for the precise solution.